Hi Pisces, it's Elle here to do your April love reading. It is a general reading, so it will not resonate with every Piscean. But if it resonates with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It is much appreciated. All right, Pisces, let's get into this. All right. Pisces. What's going on for Pisces and love, Lord God? Thank you for blessing this reading. Amen. All right. Eight of Swords. So, I don't know if you feel like you're being isolated or you've been shut out. You don't see a way out of um, something that's going on over and over again. You're thinking about something over and over again. Something that was said or not said or something maybe that was implied you've kind of given up here in terms of what's what's going to happen next i don't know if you're feeling like you're going to be rescued if you're waiting for something else or somebody else to come in that'll take you out of this out of this relationship or out of this place or this place of lack or despair, D, or I don't know. You just you've given up in terms of I'm gonna make a decision. I'm just going you just kind of letting it all happen, letting it all transpire. Um Yeah, it's kind of like you're giving up agency over your life right now. Um you feel stuck too. But only because you just don't want to think your way out of it. You don't want to find a way out. It's easier to just stay here. It's easier to just deal. Yeah. Okay. Or, or that's how somebody feels in terms of dealing with you. Some of you just don't see how you can get out of this. Or get away from this. Um, you might want to be somewhere else too. Or with someone else. Alright. How does your person feel? Well, how does Pisces feel? I think we asked, what's the situation? Yeah. How does Pisces feel? How does Pisces feel? Ooh. Two of swords, six of swords. So you're thinking about cutting somebody off or out. This says, be cautious about cutting off loved ones, you know, whether that's your romantic person, partner, or, or just loved ones. You don't know if you need to make up with this person or make it work or just move on. Yeah, or move on solo. It's almost as if you don't want to suffer another failure, but at the same time, you want to get back out there or you want to... You don't know if you should reconcile with this person. You don't know if they'll have you back. Something about it needing to be logical, rational, and needing to make sense. There needs to be some cooperation. Your heart and your mind are not on the same page. So there's frustration. There's conflict. There's not cooperation even within yourself. So it's like you want to cut something out. Then you just don't know. Then you stay. Then you don't know how to get out of it. Then you know how to move on. It's um interesting, very interesting energy. You're very much in your in your thoughts. You're really trying to mold something over in terms of what kind of sense does it make? Does it add up? Does it work? You also don't want to experience this failure, also. You don't want to walk away in shame or you don't want someone else to walk away in shame. You don't want to give up. This looks like the ego right here. Yeah, this, yeah, this is the ego. You don't want to go into that transition. And you got to decide if you're going to do that. Let's see how your person feels. How does Pisces person feel? How does Pisces person feel?
Five of Pentacles. They feel, you know, kind of left out, destitute. Uh, they don't have a lot of confidence in this moving forward because there's some change that has transpired. And I, I definitely see that there's change that's transpired. But you get all these swords cards. Somebody's up in their mind and their head about where is this going. I don't know if it's just the summertime, springtime. Things are heating up and people are feeling like they need a little space. Um, but your partner, if there is one or a specific person, they're feeling like they don't see this moving forward. Not in the manner that they that the both of you will be happy about forward movement in. They may have even kind of um, withdrawn themselves. OK, so they have lack of confidence in forward movement. They only have the lack of confidence because they don't know how you feel. They don't know what's going to happen. They are unsure of themselves. So when you don't have confidence, it's only because you don't have knowledge. You, you guys need to have a conversation. Somebody may feel as if they don't have enough or they can't be enough for you or they're not enough for you. Once again, lack of confidence here. What's the outcome between Pisces and their person? Somebody feels like they're too far from you also. Uh, I don't know what that means. What's the outcome of Pisces? You're getting two cards. Okay, so the Knight of Cups and the Five of Swords, more swords, Jesus Christ. Four of Swords at the bottom of the deck. I don't know if you're going to wait for like some clarity from spirit. I don't know if you're going to ask this person out, if you're going to extend your love, your cup of love again, or vice versa. This is what they're doing. But you need to question your motives here. What is this about? Is it this that you just don't want this to fail? You don't want failure to rest here because this is another failure under the belt. Or you really want this person. You're really trying to fight for your your space in this connection. Somebody just wants to win here. They want to be the chosen one. Someone knows that there's um, suspicions of uh, cheating or someone stepping outside of the relationship. So they're kind of taking a break and backing off here a little bit. Um, someone is also thinking about, do we do we come back together and how does that look? Someone could be just trying to offer love because they want to keep you there. They want to keep you confused or keep you in the fold. Somebody feels differently about a particular person also. I don't know if they voice this to this person. It's bad blood between... You and uh, somebody you love could be Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, an Aquarius, young Aquarius, somebody who's defending their em emotions. They're defensive about their emotions. Someone who you've taken a break from. You always knew it would be a temporary break. You always knew that you guys would come back around. Looks like your emotions and your thoughts are attacking you all at once, which is making you or pushing you to... Uh, either um, offer yourself or offer apology or offer something. Or this is how someone else is, you know, viewing you or viewing the connection with you. They're, they're going through the dark night of the soul that is forcing them to a place of um, reconciliation. Reconciling didn't mean that you're going to get back together. It could just be reconciling to come to terms with and move on. Definitely could be dealing with an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. All right, Pisces, if this resonates with you, go over to the website, book your own reading there. Take advantage of the text question or you can text the question to the number below. You can always donate to the channel by clicking the buy me a coffee link. Thank you, Pisces. Take care. Many blessings.